first tonight, we have major news in campaign 2016 as former Rhode Island Governor Lincoln Chafee announces that he may be running for President of the United States. New tonight, it's news that's making a political splash across the country and surprising many right here in Rhode Island. Highway to News reporter Kelly Sullivan has been working this story all day and night. She joins us now live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom with new reaction tonight. Well, many haven't seen or heard from former Governor Lincoln Chafee since he left office late last year, but he surfaced today in a big way, making headlines not only in the ocean state, but across the country. I'm Lincoln former Chafee. Governor Lincoln Chafee Democrat, chose to use the World Wide Web president to announce he's possibly running for president. The 2016 election is an important one. And quickly, a face that hasn't been seen for months was headlining the national news websites. USA Today, The Washington Post, Bloomberg, just to name a few. I'm very surprised to hear that. I really didn't know he had any intentions of running, th running for any position other than the, uh, you know, within the state of Rhode Island. While the news is surprising for many, some here in the Ocean State don't think Chafee stands a chance. Well, he doesn't have national recognition, and he's a small-time guy. He's just not in the big league. He doesn't have the brains, he doesn't have the uh, insights, and he doesn't have the record. In our exclusive Eyewitness News Providence Journal poll in October of 2014, then-Governor Lincoln Chafee had an unfavorable rating among voters by 53 percent. I, I want to... Rhode Islanders to know that uh, my record is not only as mayor but as governor uh, is a good one and uh, hopefully those popularity numbers will be better. But it is true, sometimes when I travel outside the state, they remember uh, my votes against the Bush tax cuts, the votes against the war in Iraq and, uh, and, and they like that. The former mayor, governor and U.S. senator does have supporters who are wishing him well as he seeks a potential run. So he certainly knows the political world and good luck to him. Now, in sitting down with Chafee today, he tells me he plans on having an exploratory committee meet with Democratic chairs in cities and towns in Iowa and New Hampshire in the upcoming weeks. But he says there's no timeline for when he plans to announce if indeed he is running for president. Reporting live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.